Hello, welcome back to my channel, Cassie's Gaming. Today I'm playing Horizon Forbidden West, and please subscribe, and let's play. Can I ask you something? Of course. There are still more voices for me to find. I hope I get the chance to learn from them. The ones we have will teach us much. Did the Delver say anything about where to find the recordings? Only that she found them in ancient flying machines, and that they were sending out some sort of signal. There is a locator signal from the recording. I can detect it with my... Relic. That should help me find any more voices that are out there. What will you do with the recordings? Well, I'll have to speak to my superiors and see if we can make space for them. They aren't from the Ten, but the voices of all warriors must be heard and remembered. I'll let you know if I find more voices. Blood of the Ten, Aloy. Regala denied. The truth of the visions revealed. I doubt you have enough skin to mark all your deeds. We'll just have to remember them, then. <laughs> well, thanks to you, the Chief still lives. And hope remains. But that's not why I wanted to speak with you. I need a favor. A personal one. My grandson, Kavor. He was not counted among the dead, which means he must still be with Regala's remaining forces. He was taken prisoner? No. He joined them willingly. Like many young soldiers who seek to mark their skin with distinguished deeds. I must search for him. Convince him to come home. Chief Hikaru cannot spare any soldiers for this task, so my blade is alone in this. Unless you'd be willing to join me. I know it is much to ask after all you've done for us. The Cavo is the last of my blood. What made Cavo join Regala's rebellion? For some, Regala represents a chance of vengeance against the Karja. During the Red Raids, it wasn't easy to turn the clans back at Baron Light. Many wanted to pursue the Karja all the way to Meridian. So when Regala attacked the Embassy, they took it as a call to arms. Yes. But others, the young especially, care only about the glory they think they'll earn by hunting an age-old enemy. As for Kavo, it was probably a bit of both. And a youthful desire for a cause to get the blood burning. Nothing I said could stop him. You said Kavo is your last living relative? Yes. Before Chief Ikaro, the clans war constantly with each other. Every skirmish claimed another comrade. One by one, I buried my children. And then, their children. I'm sorry. I tried to vent my grief on the battlefield. But I never found comfort there. Only in the wisdom of the visions. 
And even so, I still couldn't prevent Cavo from following the trail of blood. If Cavo joined Regala's rebellion of his own accord, will Hikaru let him back into the tribe? The chief knows the value of mercy and the toll of unending bloodshed. The rest of the tribe I'm more concerned about. They won't quickly accept someone who betrayed them. Even with my support, it won't be easy. But you have to try. I'll help you find your grandson, if I can. Where do we start? A while back, our scouts reported Cavo's squad left one of Regala's outposts in the hills to the south. His squad never returned, but the scouts also spotted one of our own being held captive there. So we'll start at the outpost. If we free the prisoner, maybe they'll know where Cavo's squad went. Shall we head out? Let's go. Good. This way. The outpost isn't far. Could you imagine what it feels like? Charging at an enemy blade in hand? Walking on. You know, the rebels aren't going to give up without a fight. Then we'll have to give them one. The bloodshed won't end until Regala is defeated. But what matters is the soldier they took captive, Nikala. She's been their prisoner for some time now. She's my only lead to finding Cabo. We'll get her back. And then Cabo too. The outpost should be just ahead. You take point, I'll follow. Rebels, I need to get rid of their leader. Maybe then the rest will retreat. That? I didn't see anything. Dead. Recent. Get searching. Oh, 
see a diversion. We should go back to our post. Movement. There. Trouble here! On target! Much better. That's all of them. Our scouts said they saw Nakala tied up at a wood post. Let's look around. There, that's the post. Oh, no Nakala, obviously. But maybe the rebels moved her. I can look for tracks. Everything there. Tracks leading away from the post. Where do they go?
There's rope. Just enough to bind someone. Blood. From the rebels or Nikala? Dead end. No. I think there's something under that wood. Take my hand, Nicola. Steady now. Where am I? Chaplain? Is that you? And with an outlander. Whoa. How'd you end up down there? Rebels had me strung up. They thought I'd give up intel about lowland squad movements by letting me bake in the sun. Managed to slip my bonds and make a run for it. They made me pay for that. Last thing I remember was a crack on the head and the taste of dirt. How'd you end up here? We're looking for Cabo. His squad was last spotted leaving this outpost. Yeah, he was here. It was his squad that attacked us on the road. My comrades got away, but I was taken. Cabo tied me to the post himself. If you're looking for him, Chaplain, I'm afraid you'll only find a dead end. His loyalties are clear. Do you know where his squad went? I overheard them mention Fall's Edge. Then we'll... we'll pick the search up from there. I'll go ahead and meet you at Fall's Edge, southwest of here. Dekka, if Cabo attacked her squad... No! He's not lost to us yet! We have to find him and turn him from this path. Okay. We'll see you there. What about you? That wound needs to be looked at. It'll scar. I just need to rest a bit, then I'll report into the grove. I'm telling you, Bloodhair. The chaplain might not want to hear it, but her grandson is a traitor. I guess we'll see about that. Take a look at the leader's body before I go. Check them for tax. Holding up.
Place falls edge. Becca should be waiting for me in there. Telling the truth. Listen to him, Aroke. Not a chance. Decca, what's going on? Aloy, I'm glad you're here. This is Aroke, leader of Fall's Edge. So you've enlisted the Chief's champion in your dull bladed efforts. You must be Kavo then, my grandson, and a soldier trying to right his mistakes. Or trying to lure us into a trap. My scouts caught him. Sneaking around on the outskirts of the village. I wasn't sneaking around. I was coming to warn you. The rebels are planning an attack. They're going to send a machine straight through this village. I left my post when I realized what they were planning. You have to believe me. Where are the rebels now? They were hunting for the machine north of here. I, I can show you the way. The only thing you'll do is face trial by combat. You betrayed your clan. Your chief. Blood and blades will decide your fate. I'll fight whoever you want after we stop the attack. Why destroy this village? I thought Regala's fight was with Hikaru. Hikaru was a lowlander before he was chief. Unlike the Desert and Sky clans, we stand behind him without question. Fall's Edge is a strategic midpoint between the Grove and our capital on the coast. It's true. Our orders were to cut off Hikaru's support from the Lowland clan. But I thought that meant disrupting supply routes, not slaughtering an entire village. You said you defected after you found out about the attack. Why'd you change your mind? When I joined the rebels, I thought Pagala was going to lead us into battle against our old enemy, the Karja. But all we've done is kill each other. And for what? Pride. Vengeance. So when my squad leader told us about the mission to destroy this village, I left my post. Don't believe his lies. Anyone who deserted the tribe to join Regala knew exactly what they were getting themselves into. Not everyone. If Cavo is telling the truth, this whole village is in danger. We have to find and stop these rebels. The rebels? Built a campfire north of the river, near the cliffs. I can show you the way from there. Okay. Open it up, or okay? No. I won't give- Then I invoke blood for blood. I will take Cavo's place until- You're making a mistake, Chaplain. The clan- The right has- Then I'm going to. If he lies, I'll run him through. I must make arrangements here first. Then I'll bring the boy to the meeting place. Fine. I'll see you there.